So first we need an integrated development environment or a code editor for writing program. For all of the demonstrations on this course, I am using Visual Studio Code. The reason I am using Visual Studio Code is that it's free, open source and suitable for cross platform. The experience is the same on Windows, Linux and Mac and it's perfectly fine for writing C-sharp code and TypeScript code. In fact, it's an excellent TypeScript editor, uh, but it is your personal choice. You can use Visual Studio instead of Visual Studio Code. But I would recommend if you are fairly new to this and you don't already have a preference, then I would say you just go ahead and use Visual Studio Code. I'll be describing shortcut tips and tricks for the Visual Studio Code as we go through the course. So come to your browser and Google Visual Studio Code. Enter the code.visualstudio.com website. You are going to download the latest version of Visual Studio Code from here. And you can download either for Windows or Mac or for Linux. I will download and install for Windows 64 bit machine. Now if it is not started promptly, you may click on direct download link. Save the software somewhere in your machine and it may take a couple of minutes based on your internet speed to download the software. Once the download is finished, go to the folder and double click on the Visual Studio Code setup.exe file. Accept license agreement and click next. Keep the extension folder as it is and click next. Then click next again. Check create desktop icon box if you want a shortcut. Check other two boxes and click next. Click install button and wait for completing setup process. It may take a couple of minutes again for installing the software. Once installation is done, click on finish button. Now open up Visual Studio Code from your shortcut or you can open from your start menu. This is the welcome page of Visual Studio Code and your installation was successful. I will introduce Visual Studio Code more details and describe its functionalities in the upcoming videos. So go ahead and check the future videos. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe the channel.